back with another video. Today, me and my mom, this is her. My name is Charday. So excited. Okay, so we're trying Briere tacos for the first time. I know I'm not saying that ethically enough, but that's how we're gonna say it. So we went to this place. I'll insert the clip of what it is. Um, um, and then we got some Briere tacos. So you can see that, looks great onions got some sauce over here that has cheese on it and then these ones have no cheese and it's different types we got al pastor carnitas and pollo, pollo. which is chicken what did you say polo no. <laughs> <laughs> marco polo <No. laughs> i'm glad i did a little bit of spanish <laughs> okay they gave us a spoon i guess for the sauce Let's see what this looks like. That's all this greasy stuff. Grease? Mm. You know they dip it in the sauce. Oh, that's what I seen them do. The shell in the sauce. Yes. Yeah. And there are so many onions. Yes, I'm in heaven. I'm not the biggest fan of onions. Oh yeah, look at that. Look at that sauce. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Alright. Let's start with the let's start with the rear. And then we'll go into the to the other one. Like some hot stuff. Oh, this might be the salsa. That's the spicy salsa. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and get this one right here because it's got the least amount of onions. I got onions. Take my coat off. I need to get. You need to get comfortable. <laughs> you need to get in there. You know, get in there. Get in there. All right, let me take some of these onions off and give it to you. Oh, wow, it's like all over. It's okay. All right, it's embedded. Yeah. Take the little lime, squeeze the juice everywhere. Put the lime in the coconut. Where is that from? <laughs> <laughs> that sounds familiar. Where's that from? I don't know. I, feel like I just remember it. Like the coconut, like the shit up. Put the weed in the coconut, like the shit up. Put the weed in the coconut, like the shit up. You put the weed in the coconut and light that shit up. You put the weed in the coconut and you light that shit up. Stop it, though. I got a bad feeling about this flight. Go first. See this one right there. Oh yeah, look at that. Whoa. 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 It's mad juicy. Whoa. Get into the sauce, y'all. I think I'm doing a mother thing and shit. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Good. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Let me see. Okay. Let me try for the first time. Gotta give you an honest reaction, mom. What is it? What is it giving you? Mm. Is it all you ever imagined? Do the videos do you justice? I'm not sure about the sauce. Does it have a taste to it? It's supposed to be uh, beef is not eating. Oh, okay. It tastes good, but I don't have a, I don't get a sauce taste from that. No. It's like a grease or something. Ew. Mm. It's gonna be, um, I can't quite remember. It's got a nice crunch to it. Yes, I like that part. Yeah. That's the El Pastor. It's got the pineapple on top. That's probably chicken and that's probably carnitas. You know what? The onions aren't bothering me. I've been eating carnitas at Chipotle. I do love a carnitas moment. Mm. I haven't tasted no sauce. Damn. What? I, the salsa? Mm -hmm. Really? You must have put none on mine. I put a little bit.
This almost tastes like like mixed barbecue. Mm -hmm. I got the barbecue sauce. If I'm gonna like this, I might rather have a brio. Mm, that's pretty good. Oh, that's just hot. Mm. Okay. Ooh. We're yeah. spice people, so when we say something hot, you got a nice kick to it. Alright, let me try this in the sauce. It's always cold in my car. Cross Saturday. <laughs> I'm putting that in. <laughs> you ain't right. It's obviously her side is going through. Um. How you feel about that one? It's not as flavorful as I'd like it to be. Quite basic, actually. I can't tell what spices are in it. I prefer the brie over the carnita. Me too. You didn't try it. <laughs> no. You don't like the apple store? It's pretty good. I did try Let it. Let me get a bite. Ooh. Ooh. I gotta put a lot of that sauce on there. Ooh. I have really that. I'm lacking in some Come on, you got all them onions right there. That's good. It's good. It's eh? a little sweet. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's got a lot more flavor than this though. Yeah. Put a like in the videos. I'm gonna take the first bite, and then here you go, you take the second one. <laughs> like, man. It was worth the wait. Yeah, I will be back. I will be back. Definitely recommend. Um, try out time on the Briera. Now, carnitas is like a five. I just, I don't know, it's got no, it ain't got no spice, no sweet, no. no nothing. It's bland. How you can keep saying that? You didn't even try it. I did eat some of it off the oh, top. Oh, off the top. I wanted to taste the meat. Um, so you gave it to me, you know it was bland? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Says a lot about you, bud. What the chicken taste like? Mm, I got mixed reviews on it. I want half of that. Three ish, and you take half of this chicken because I'm not really a big fan of it. Okay. You definitely don't need more than three. Mm. No they way. Do, they do a three, what was it? Three for 13 if you get three of the same flavor. Oh, that's just hot. Mm. Okay. Ooh. We're yeah. spice people, so when we say something hot, I got a nice kick hot. to it. Try this in the sauce. It's always cold in my car. Cross out of there. <laughs> I'm putting that in. <laughs> you ain't right. It's obviously her side is going through. Um. How you feel about that one? 
It's not as flavorful as I'd like it to be. It's quite basic, actually. I can't tell what spices are in it. Prefer the brie over the carnitas. Make up. You didn't try it. <laughs> no. You don't like the apple store? It's pretty good. I did try it. Let me it. get a bite. Ooh. Ooh. I gotta put a lot of that sauce on there. Ooh. I have to that. I'm lacking in flavor. Come on, you got all them onions right there. That's good. It's good. It's eh? a little sweet. Mm -hmm. That's good. That's got a lot more flavor than this stuff. Yeah. Leave a like in the videos. I'm gonna take the first bite, and then here you go. You take the second one. <laughs> like, man. Come over here, leaking like a faucet. You, you got juice somewhere. Right there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll be back. I'll be back. Definitely recommend. Um, try out Chow on the Briere. Now, Carnitas is like a five. I just, I don't know, it's got no, it ain't got no spice, no sweet, no, no nothing. It's bland. How you can keep saying that? You didn't even try it. I did eat some of it off the oh, top. Off the top. I wanted to taste the meat. Um, so you gave it to me, you know what was playing? Mm -hmm. <laughs> this is a lot about you, bud. What the chicken taste like? Mm, I got mixed reviews on it. I want half of that brioche, and you take half of this chicken because I'm not really a big fan of it. Okay. You definitely don't need more than three. Mm. No they way. Do, they do a three. What was it three for thirteen? If you get three of the same flavor. Wait, wait. I lied. Um, don't listen to me because I said flavor, and it's three of the same meat. So definitely get three of the same meat for 14 cooking. if you get mix three. and match. Yeah. But they're filled to capacity, so. Yeah, it's a little food truck. So you better get here when you get here. And if you don't get here when you get here, you might not get it. You might miss out. We were ordering at four, like 4.45 and they yeah. were already like, oh, we don't know if we have any meat left. Yeah, she had to check back and was like, yeah, we're running low on that, so. Definitely. Plus, when, once we were done, the line got long for people getting off work. I don't know how to split this up. Yeah, somehow you gotta break it. It's mad juicy. It's stuffed with meat, though. They didn't. They don't give you a shortage on that. It's actually a lot. Sauce is like like when you make home tacos in the grease of Japan. Oh. Taste this chicken. Put a little spice on it. I'll be eating a slam for it when I get home. Definitely worth the ride. Depending on where you are. 
that's not far from mine, so this is definitely a go to spot now. Yeah. I like the chicken. You do? Mm -hmm. I don't know, it's giving me a weird vibe. No, I dropped it. It ain't bad, but I can't quite. It's something you gotta get used to. Correct. It's a, I don't know. Maybe it's the season and they put them up. Yeah. On the menu it says um, what is family, it? like family traditional spices. So oh, that's why. Whatever they put in it. All right, pick me up. Damn, I lost my earphone. And this is the only location. What? It was here and then, what was it? Saying, saying something, I don't know. But somewhere else? Mm-hmm. Oh. I thought this was the only location. Oh, no, what? On the East Coast. Oh, okay. I didn't have hot. It blew up overnight. They're asking people to make more trucks in different locations. Oh, really? Yeah. But he said he's just trying to focus on this one right now. Just been, it's been like the halfway mark for East and West. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to finish this, finish this up. Whatever other video comes, is what comes. Peace. Peace. Okay, so we didn't really like give a full review, but um, basically the Briere, Briere, um, tacos were amazing. We got those with the cheese only, um, super cheesy. It was so good. Um, then we got three other types of meat, which is the polo. See, my mom's influencing me. Pollo, chicken, um. El Pastor, which is pork, and then Carnitas, which is also pork. Um, all these are their own, whatever they feel is traditional spices, um, family family style. Um, me, personally, and my mom, I didn't like the Carnitas. Um, we have another taco joint, like, right up the street from us, who kills it on Carnitas. Um, if, just for me, if it kind of tastes like plain pork. I, I don't know, I was expecting a little more spice. Um, but that was good. The El Pastor is good. It's really tender. Oh, but the carne is, is tender too. So it's tender. It just, it didn't have enough spice for me or flavor. Um, I even ate it again later that night, hoping some, some flavor would seep into it. But it just, no, I had, I had to throw it away. I didn't even finish it. Um, the El Pastor has like some pineapple kind of sweetness to it, which is really good. Like that one was definitely really good. Um, super tender. They chop it up in like little cute pieces. And then right after that, right after that, um, we had the, we had the chicken. Um, that was good to me. She didn't like it as much. Um, it was very, like, none of those things were spicy. I guess that's why they give you the hot or verde salsa. But none of it was spicy. But I thought the chicken was well seasoned and it was tender. And they also chop it up in little bits. Um, I think we both thought that the, the dip, the broth, was, a, was more of a sauce type thing. And it wasn't, so we were a little surprised by that. But overall, when you eat it with the tacos, it tastes really good and it just soaks it up. So definitely worth a try, definitely go there. It's Mexican on the run, I believe. It's located in Towson in Baltimore, Maryland. Yeah, in Baltimore, Maryland, in Towson. Um, definitely a, let me think, definitely eight out of 10. So if you, if you wanna see us do more um, mukbangs, mukbangs, trying videos, then comment down below but thank you for watching this video um if you stayed till the end or if you didn't um subscribe down below definitely drop a like if you want to see it again and leave a comment oh and don't forget to turn on that post notification bell thank you bye